Now I thrifted this beautiful sequence blazer. <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Shanika E. And in today's video, I have a few holiday looks for you guys. They are featuring my latest thrift finds as well as a few pieces that I picked up from Chic In. The company reached out to me and asked me to pick out a few pieces for this holiday season. So if you're interested in any of these looks, please check the description box down below. I will also put my coupon code there as well as on the screen. So if you're interested in looking at a few holiday looks this season, just keep on watching. And if this is your first time stumbling on one of my videos, I do help you to elevate your home and your wardrobe using vintage and thrifted items. And in today's video, we doing that. All right, ladies, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my outfit of the day because it is featuring one of the Shein items and then we'll jump right into the haul. It's a good one. of the day I have on this white padded sweatshirt that I picked up from Shein. I am obsessed with this sweatshirt. It is so chic yet so casual at the same time which really channels my style which is like that effortlessly chic look. I have it paired with some leather trousers that I thrifted from Park Avenue Thrift. I love the fact that they are high-waisted and they have some light pleating in the front. They also kind of taper down into a nice straight leg, not quite skinny, but not flare either. So I really, really enjoy these pants for the simple black and white look will look classic all holiday season. So, you know, if you get a little bit confused and you're kind of like, what am I gonna wear? Black and white is always a good go-to look. All right, let's go ahead and clear out the rack behind me and see what other goodies that I picked up. All right, so the first item that I picked up, I am super excited about this piece. This piece screams New Year's Eve, <laughs> okay? And it is classic sequins. Now, I thrifted this beautiful sequins blazer from one of my favorite consignment thrift shops in Douglasville. Um, I will put her information in the description box below. It is Hope Floats Consignment and Thrift Shop. And y'all, get into this blazer. It has the perfect slim yet oversized look and it is covered in sequins girl okay and it has these beautiful satin lapels to kind of break up some of the sequins it catches the light beautifully and they are black but if you kind of go the other way with them they are kind of like a silver but not that gaudy silver so again it just creates that perfect sheen i plan on pairing them with one of my Shein items and i'm not sure if i'm going to pair them with my leather or my faux leather leggings or my faux leather shorts but let me show both of those items to you now so here are those faux leather shorts that i was telling you guys about I love these shorts. I like that they're really, really lightweight. However, the shape is what does it for me. They're a beautiful A-line shape, so they'll fit you in the waist and they just kind of flow away from your body. I sized up for these in a size 0XL because I did want them to really barely skim my legs and just flow over them. I also knew that I wanted to wear these in other ways this winter tucking in a chunky knit. So having a little bit more room to tuck that chunky knit into is going to be perfect. I can even wear it with the sweatshirt that I have on. You're gonna see these shorts several times throughout this video because they are just that good. They do have front pockets and they have a space for a belt. Now, sometimes your sheet in items will look, mm, sometimes they can lend a little bit cheap. So being able to add on your own personal accessory, being the belt to kind of lux it up a little bit is going to be perfect for me. So again, I am not sure if I'm gonna pair these shorts with my sequence blazer that I picked up from Hope Floats Consignment Shop. But 
Again, you, you will see these shorts throughout the video. By the way, I failed to mention that I picked up this blazer for $35 from the Hope Floats Consignment and Thrift Shop. I will put the prices of the sheet and items on the screen when I'm editing because I do not remember exactly how much each item was. So make sure to just look down on the bottom of the screen for the prices for the sheet and items. So the next thrifted item is yet another blazer. If you've been following me for a while, you know your girl loves, <laughs> I'm talking about loves a good blazer. And I picked up this blazer here. Now I do have a blazer very similar to this one already in my wardrobe however i just love a good double breasted blazer and this hunter green color is just a really good neutral so i plan on pairing this with those leather shorts a black tank and my black heels that i picked up from ego i feel like this would be a really really good holiday look I mean, if you're going to a holiday party, you can even kind of squeeze it into a New Year's depending on where you're going. But I absolutely love the color combination, super chic and effortless, and I think that you would enjoy it as well. Comment down below and let me know what you think about this outfit. The next thrifted piece that I also plan to wear with those leather shorts is this beautiful cardigan here. Now, I talked about cardigans in my previous videos. They are going to be all over this winter season, and I believe well into the spring, depending on, you know, whether it's lightweight or heavier. Anywho, this one I picked up from Park Avenue Thrift for $5.45. Now, I am obsessed with the silhouette and how it hangs. So it has a beautiful dropped shoulder and it has these buttons here in the center. I like that they are cream, so they kind of just blend in with this pattern. This pattern is what sold me. I don't know where this is originally from. There's no tags on it. It almost looks like it was like hand knitted. It is so, so good. Again, with the black and white for holidays, you cannot go wrong. And it has this nice billowy sleeve that tapers just slightly at the wrist. Super, super cute. This tucked into some leather pants, leather shorts, or even just, you know, putting some leather leggings with this for a more relaxed look is going to be really, really cute. And if you really want to get festive with it, pop on a red lip and you'll be good to go. So the next item that I picked up from Shein is just some simple classic leather leggings. I really needed a pair of leather leggings, but what I really like about these leather leggings is they do have the little slit detailing in the front, which is going to show off your shoes. I picked these up in an extra large again, so I can have a little bit more room. I didn't want them to be too, too tight, showing all of, you know, the dicks and dimples because your girl have them, okay? So I sized up a little bit with these, but not too much. Now, I plan on wearing these with this leather um, blazer that I picked up. I think this was last season, but this leather on leather look, a nice lacy bra underneath, some really strappy black heels. I'm probably pairing them with the same black heels from the previous look. Those are from Ego. If they're available, I will link them down below. But an all black look, it just, it never fails, okay? You're gonna look chic, you're gonna look cute, you're gonna look just like, oh my gosh, she's ready, she's ready. <laughs> the next item that I picked up from Shein is this beautiful shirt dress. Now, the quality on this shirt dress, it is just, it is really, really nice. So it has a really good weight to it. It has two large pockets in the front. It has an overall um, baggy silhouette, so I didn't need to size up. I got my normal size, which is a size large. Has nice, roomy, kind of almost like a billowy sleeve, but very structured. And then, of course, tapered on the end. It has two slits on the side to help when you're walking. I plan on pairing these with those same black heels from Shoe Dazzle and then throwing in this cute little paper boy hat. Now, I have been seeing these on my favorite YouTubers, Hilo Lux, Pockets and Bows, and they have been 
killing it. Also Monroe Steel. So I decided to try my hand at it and I picked this Paperboy hat up from Amazon. If it is still available, I will link it in the description box below. All right, moving on to another thrifted item that I picked up this week and it is these gorgeous girls. <laughs> I, I couldn't believe that they were there. These are 100% genuine leather trousers and they are in this beautiful, deep, rich cognac color. They are a true straight leg. I picked these up for only $3.69. The only gripe that I have with these is they do not have belt loops. Again, I love to cinch in the waist and add a little bit of character with a belt. However, these does not have that option, but you can put the belt over the top and kind of have that faux belted look. I am obsessed. Like when you find quality like this in the thrift store and then you match them up to <laughs> some of your other pieces like the ones that I am showing you today, I am reminded that the thrift store, it's just, it's just my baby. It's just the way to go, in my opinion. These beautiful 100% genuine leather pants just proves that for me. And in this gorgeous color, I mean, come on. <laughs> come on. Now, I uh, plan on wearing these with another thrifted item that I found that I was really excited to find in the thrift store and it is another padded tee very similar to this one but it is sleeveless and i picked this up from park avenue thrift dollars and 65 cent this was originally from asos and it is in a size four which is not your girl size however it gives a very slim tapered look so i like to make sure that i have a really good portion control with my outfits because I am bottom heavy and I don't want to get lost in them. So the pants are a size too big. So having them with this very tight shirt at top kind of creates that portion control that I am looking for. But again, it's just a simple black padded tee, but it's made very, very well. And I can wear this well into the spring. So again, these beautiful, <laughs> cognac 100% leather pants with this black shirt it's just a vibe you guys know how I feel about black and brown and this cognac is just a variation of brown the next two she and items that I want to show you guys I am extremely excited about they are very much on trend and again as I stated in my previous videos when you are trying to try out trends she in is the best place to go for that they are always going to have the latest trends. Sometimes you can find them at really good top quality in these two. They definitely are. So I picked up two bubble vests. One in this just traditional black, but this one is more kind of like an oversized fit. And then I have this one in this beautiful green. Um, it's more of, you know, your, st your standard fit. It's not quite cropped, but it is not regular either you guys will see when i try them on but these are just so cute i plan on wearing these when i am going shopping for my last minute items for my son i've actually already worn this one on thanksgiving it is just so comfortable it's just i know i keep saying it but again that is my personal style it is just effortlessly chic it has two drawstrings on the bottom. So if you wanna pull them in at your waist to kind of cinch in your waist, mm, it is so good. Pairing this with a nice your sweatsuit, you can do an all black look. You can also put a cute flannel underneath here with some sweats and some shoes. I mean, the sky is the limit. I'm not sure exactly how I'm gonna style this right now, but I'm sure you guys are seeing a split screen of how I chose to style this black one. Again, the sizes and the prices for the sheet in items are in the description box below. Now, I must admit that when this one came in, I was a little bit disappointed because 
On the website, it looked more like the Kelly Green color that is so much on trend, and I absolutely love that color. However, this is a little bit deeper than the Kelly Green, which is fine. So I plan on wearing this with just a white button up underneath, some wide leg jeans and some boots and be good to go this one you can actually wear on christmas day it's green it's festive however it's extremely comfortable so you're going to be eating and chilling with your family in my opinion you need some casual looks for this holiday season the last item that i picked up is from shein as well and it is this beautiful cohort set it is a slightly oversized cardigan paired with a matching knit top underneath. This was one of those pieces that I was really excited to get. However, when it got here, it really kind of fell flat for me. It didn't have enough structure and the color is Mm, a little bit off as well. I wanted it to be a little bit richer, a little bit deeper, just kind of like a, a dusty brown, but I will make it work. I really like the knit top underneath though. So I'll probably be wearing this knit top with a lot of my blazers this winter and well into the spring as well. But I plan on wearing this with probably those leather leggings that I picked up from Shein as well with some lug sole boots, a very casual look. Again, if you're going shopping for the holiday season, or this could also be a Christmas day look as well. Very chill and relaxed and comfortable. And I think I picked this up in a size large. Now, um, again, the silhouette is good in theory, but it wasn't quite executed well. It does have a nice drop shoulder. And I thought that the sleeves were going to be a little bit more billowy and a little bit more tapered at the, um, at the wrist. So again, I would not really recommend this one. However, it's cute for, you know, it's just kind of lounging around. All right, ladies, that's it for me this week. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this holiday haul featuring my latest thrift finds as well as a few Shein pieces. Please remember that there's a description box has all of the sizing as well as my coupon code. So if you're interested in any of these items or you just like to surf their website and find your own items, that description box is where you need to be. All right, ladies, if you enjoyed, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up, like, share, and subscribe, and check me out for more bomb content. I will see you all in my next video. Bye, y'all. Oh, you're